Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you again so much for our time together. Have you ever noticed in the Holy Week movies, they always present Jesus during his arrest and trial as if he was a beaten, broken man whose will had been broken and there was no strength left within him? Well, as you read through the Gospels, you find exactly the opposite. Every year during Holy Week, I love teaching you how when Jesus said, I am he, and demonstrated his sovereign authority, the entire armed mob that came to arrest him fell to the ground on their faces before him. I said, why did Jesus do that? Well, because he was about to ask them to let the other apostles go free. Now, have you ever tried to negotiate with a crowd that feels more powerful than you? So Jesus displayed his power, then he made his request, and you notice none of the apostles got arrested. But I also want you to notice, even when he was brought in before the high priest, in John chapter 18, they slap him in the face as he stands before Annas. And Jesus answered, if what I said is wrong, bear witness that I'm wrong. But if what I said is right, why did you strike me? Then Annas sent him bound to Caiaphas, the high priest. Fascinating. They had him bound. They slap him. And Jesus still stands there in the strength of who he is and says, I've done nothing wrong. Why did you strike me? He still stands in his authority. Now, this is so important, brothers and sisters, not to show that Jesus is macho, but to always remember Jesus said, no man takes my life. I lay it down of my own accord. Jesus did not die on a cross because he was rendered helpless by the hatred and animosity of men. Jesus died on a cross because he loved you and he gave himself to die to take the punishment for your sins. No one took his life. He gave his life for you.